What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Samara Wana, a.k.a. New Creature. Right now, I'm in the process of doing a video. Um, welcome to my channel. Thank you for my subscribers. Thank you for my new subscribers. Um, I do still have my mask on, only because I've been out shopping. Um, I started off with doing, like, um, trying to get my oil changed for my car. Um, I have a business trip next week for my job that I have to attend to for four days. So I wanted to make sure my car was good. So I actually ended up getting more than just um, getting more than just an oil change, which is nice. But right now, I'm, at, I'm actually on my way <clears throat> to go to Long John Silver because I am hungry. Your girl is hungry. Right now, I'm pretty much stuck in all this traffic. I'm so yes. I have some music playing, but that's not finna happen right now. It's not letting me listen to it. Because I'm on my phone. It's so stupid. But you know what, y'all? Comment below if you guys like Long John Silver. Um, I haven't had Long John Silver um, since Tennessee. When I was living in Tennessee. So it's probably been like over five years. And don't worry, I'm being safe, y'all driving but paying attention to the road more than this phone right now it seems like everybody out with their mama and their and daddy and their and they grandmama and their and cousins they out with everybody probably school shopping I mean I did get some stuff that I uh, would like to use in the upcoming you know year for me for me and my employees so and to be honest I wanted to get some lockers I wanted to purchase some lockers like at least four lockers to place, um, you know, where I work at. Because I, I do work at a cafeteria. I'm the manager in the cafeteria, but I'm also an aftercare teacher. So I wanted to get my employees uh, the locker where, like, you know, the women or the men, they could just put, like, you know, their purses inside there when they come to work. Put, you know, put their keys in there. Make it, you know what I'm saying, feel like they're in school, too. But, um... I figured I, I would wait before I buy that. I do have a couple that I am interested in. But I think for right now, I'm going to go ahead and go an easier way for now. And I purchased, actually, because I went to Target. Yes, I did. Look at my new bag. I got myself a Nautica purse. But, um, this light just had to turn green when I was trying to do all that. It's all right. But I got some hooks. It's like the hooks that you can put on a wall without actually having to damage the wall with nails. Now, where is this restaurant? Because, you know, I'm passing McDonald's. I'm passing Chipotle. I'm about to pass Applebee's. But y'all know I ain't trying to get that. I'm looking for Long John Silver. Give me that fish. Give me that fish. It's crazy. It, I got to go through all. Oh, I think I found. Oh, that's top. Oh, yes, I found it. Oh, oh, I found it. Let me see what they got. It's been a minute. It's been a minute. Ooh. Hello, what can I get for you? Oh, uh, yes. Uh, one second. I'm sorry. All right, that's fine. Uh, can I get some fries? What does your uh, two fish combo come with? It comes with two fish, five hustle piece, and a drink. Can I do that, please? All right, and for the drink? Um, I'll do a pink lemonade if you have it. All right. Would that be all? Uh, yes. Any sauces? Uh, if you have tartar sauce, that'd be awesome. All right, seven and Thank you. Better get close to this window. I got some short arms. For right now, y'all, until I can get this paid. <laughs> of course, y'all fell. I thought that I can edit all that out. Thank you so much. Yep. Yeah. All right, y'all. So I got my food. 
get my food. Talk about taking a long time to park your car, yo. She taking it an eternity. An eternity, she took forever. But I tell y'all what, I'm about to park right here and eat. My kids probably asleep, but this is mommy time. And this is me time. Yes, I got that camera going in the back of my, I can see where I'm parking. You know what I'm saying? I done upgraded, I done upgraded. I upgrade. I know it's not, it ain't straight, so I don't want to hear nothing. I don't want y'all to say nothing of the sort. All right. So I got me a pink lemonade, as y'all can see. Take this off. A straw. But yes, this is me time. Mm, mm. I haven't had, like I told you, I haven't had this for a minute, y'all. Like, yes. Yes. It's probably what the guy gets right here. But I'm working on it. I'm working on that, but I'm, I have to. Ooh, what? Yo. Long John Silver ain't playing with it. And it came with some napkins. All this tartar sauce, you know what I'm saying? Can add that. Look at this box, though. You know what? Hold on a second, y'all. Let me make myself comfortable. I'm so short. It's probably a little better. A little better. Okay, let me show you my box. Let me show you my box. This is what I got, y'all. You see the hunter puppies right here. Got me some fries, two fish. You know it's gonna be on. Uh, I ain't finna mess it all up. Before I even eat. Amen. Okay. Haven't had a hush puppy. Ooh, and wow, it's good. Look at the size of that fish, though. It's about to rain, so I'm glad I'm right here. Here go the other one. Look at the size of this one. That's big. Sometimes I'm so used to being around my kids, but it feels kind of weird. Like, I guess eating by myself. Like if, if you're a parent, if like, you know, some of my subscribers are parents or whatever, especially like single moms. Like, do you ever, like, feel guilty sometimes, like, when you do stuff without your kids? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Not like you being mean or whatever. But, like, I feel like... I am already you that. Like, when I found out I was pregnant with my daughter. You know what I'm saying? 
it was like, uh-oh, I'm about to be a mom. I don't know how to be a mom. Didn't really know my mom. She passed away when I was eight. So, you know what I'm saying? When the nurse told me I was pregnant, I had probably every emotion, every emotion you could think of. And I think for a moment I was in shock. I was living in Naples, Florida, and I was like still shocked at the fact of me, you know, becoming a mom. You know what I'm saying? Becoming a mom. I've always been a responsible type, so it really didn't matter. But, but yeah, man, you know what I'm saying? I was in shock. She was like, hey, man, did you hear what I say? You know? Like, I already done heard that I was pregnant, but I had, my mom was somewhere else. I guess I was trying to avoid of what I heard. For like five minutes, I guess. But, once I was out of the shock mode, and she was like, hey, Samara, you understand what this pregnancy test means, right? You're having a baby. And that's when I just broke down. I just started crying. So anyway, yeah. So yeah, sometimes, you know, I've been there for my kids ever since then, day one, ever since. So when I just, you know what I'm saying? Just even like buying this food for myself right now, I feel bad because I'm, I'm not eating with my kids. But I know my kids is all right. I know my kids are straight. I know my kids is okay that I go out and buy myself something to eat. You know what I'm saying? But I think for me, it's just like, I never had that. I never had a parent to, you know what I'm saying, love me to that extent where they feel guilty just doing something for themselves because they're so used to doing it for the kids. Y'all remember that song, Trick Love the Kids? Mm. Samara love the kids. Mm -mm -mm. No. I ain't gonna lie. This fish is good now. But. It could have been a little bit better. I feel like the fish. Wasn't like. All the way fresh waiting for me. Because after I ordered it, go to the window and pay, bam, they got my stuff in the bag already. Mm. So you already know, like I know, they previously cooked this fish. It's still hot, don't get me wrong. I'm just saying, like, I, I, got, I just know the texture of it. You know what I'm saying? It was it was hot when I got it, but like you already know, they already cooked it to have it in there and like a little warmer and just pass it out when somebody orders. It's all right. I'm not gonna complain, but yo, This part right here. <clears throat> you got a vacuum up car. Look, hard as a rock. That's how I know it won't fresh. Are you freaking kidding me? I'm ripping this apart. Aren't you? They're making me want to go back up in here. Mm-mm. Just sitting there.
they're making me want to go inside y'all i'm trying to be that's why i was quiet for a minute because i'm touching the other fish and inspecting it i'm just like i'm getting unhappy about a minute here and if y'all know me and if y'all don't know y'all finna find out i'm real big on customer service I'm real big on customer service you know what i'm saying so I could go and drive through right now and complain about this or just go inside and show them how you know what i'm saying this fish is looking you know what i'm saying but i'm also the type of customer that you know will sit here and just accept it and still eat it and just like you know not eat this part but oh um, yeah, you know what? I'm not going to be going back inside, but they finna get a phone call from me. They finna get a phone call from me. Like, for real. It's ridiculous. How do you let this happen? How? It's good now. Don't get me wrong. I just wish that people would just, you know. I understand it's supposed to be fast and everything. Like fast food because you're hungry and you just want to hurry up and get something to eat. Well, don't hurry up and give me some messed up food. They want to hurry up and get my money. Hurry up and get my payment, right? Get their payment. But they don't want to, you know what I'm saying, slow it down to give me some fresh food. I work hard for my money. I work hard for the money. Mm, mm, so hard, money, money. Mm, mm, I work hard for the money, so I'm gonna be alright. Rest in peace, Donna Summers. Alright. I forgot I had another hush puppy. Can't wait to go on my um my manager's trip next week. I'm looking forward to hopefully not having to share whole uh to share my room with nobody. I always get a suite and I am praying that no one's going to be sharing with me. You know what I'm saying? Sunday night, Monday night, Tuesday night, Wednesday night, four nights? Oh, I hope I'm by myself for these four nights because, you know, you don't know who's going to come up in there. But yes, I hope you guys are having a good summer. I hope everything is going well with you and your families. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I want to say happy birthday to whoever birthday that it is today. I hope you have a good birthday. Rest in peace to someone who has passed away today. And if that is one of my subscribers... And you're just going through some hurt and pain. I'll be praying for you. Um, but yeah. I'm about to wrap it up. Get on the road before it pours down. The sky looks really dark. Especially here in Florida. I'm in uh, Fort Myers, Florida. Headed back to where I live at. But um, it's been real with y'all. My eyes just spotted one of the workers. He obviously is coming into his shift. He must work the night shift. On um, the night shift. I got a song for everything. Let me stop. But, um, yeah, so I was looking at him because part of me wants to let him know, hey, man, 
excuse me make sure you give out some fresh fish <clears throat> so yes that's pretty good but I'm done what what you need talking to my imaginary kids <laughs> it feels weird not talking to no kids in this car but I'm headed home now so I see them but yes you know what I'm saying I want to give a shout out to all my subscribers I want to thank you for watching my videos um, just thank you for, for subscribing. Thank you for being who you are. Don't ever change who you are. If you do change, you need to change because God wants you to change. You want to change to live better. But don't change because someone else wanting you to change. Because when people actually want someone to change, you know what I'm saying? They don't change. I couldn't resist another bite. Mm. I said I'm done, but I'm eating this nasty fish after a while, huh? But yes. If you tell someone or you want them to change and you keep bugging them about changing, they're not going to want to change. But if you pray in secret where no one knows you praying for them to change so that they get see the grace of God, that is the best way for someone to change. It's to just pray and ask the Lord to open up their spiritual sight. You know what I'm saying? And he'll do it. Because he's done it for me. So I'm not trying to get too deep on y'all. But you know what I'm saying? I appreciate y'all. I'm not one of the big, you, you know, the biggest YouTubers. But I do my channel because I do want to encourage people. I obviously make people have my son as calling me. I better go. Mm-hmm. <laughs> But yes, um, like, subscribe, comment, and uh, I hope y'all have a good day. I'm going to go ahead and end this video.